Hello and welcome to this new video of the list dedicated to OpenCV. You will find the link of the full list in the description below. In our last video, we saw basic operations on video with OpenCV. In this video, we will see how to make a face detection with pre-made HAR cascade. And in the next video, we will see how to create our own HAR cascade for object detection. For more information about this concept, I invite you to see this official documentation. To make things easy, consider a hard cascade a kind of model that the computer will use to find a specific thing. In our case, it will be a face. You can find a lot of XML files of hard cascade in the official repository of OpenCV. Here, I created a folder containing these files beside my Python file. There is a lot of interesting things that you can test in the same way like this video. This is our last program that just captures an image from the default camera and a display on the screen. The first thing you should do is to call the classifier XML file. Create a variable that will contain the output of the block. My XML file is inside the hard cascade directory. The block uh, detector multiscale will use uh, the input classifier to find uh, the specific uh, feature. In our case, it will be uh, faces. If you use, for example, the full body XML file, it will uh, return uh, the bodies inside uh, the photo. Give the frame as a parameter in uh, the image part. For the other parameters, they will be used to improve the precision. I invite you to read the documentation. For now, I will keep uh, the default uh, values. The block detect multiscale will return a list of found faces. Now I will loop into the variable faces. Every item contains the position of the face. The variable uh, face item contains four values about uh, the position. To extract four values from a single variable, we will use uh, the block set to several uh, variables. The first parameter of the block is the input variable. The others are the output variables. In our case, we have a four, x, y, the width and the height of the image. Now we will draw an image around the face.
Now we are ready to test our program. And uh, here we are. I hope that you liked the video and see you soon in the next one about creating your own hard cascade for object detection. Bye.